Hi, I'm Mario with Life Saving Systems. We're going to talk about how to stow the crotch strap uh, in a quick strap. Uh, this question comes up. Uh, it's pretty simple, but it can be uh, a little confusing if, if you're not sure what the goals are. And so what the goals are the, of the stowage of the crotch strap, of course, is to have it out of the way when you're not needing it and then have it easily accessible when you do. The way this pocket is designed, this is the key, is there's a piece of uh, pile tape, a uh, Velcro here, on this side. And at the end of the device, there's the hook tape here. So you want to accordion fold this crotch strap in a way that makes it line up with that. Uh, and so if it fits in the pocket, if the Velcro is attached here and it zips shut, you've done it right. So it's sort of a self-critiquing skill. But the way to do it is you extend, you know, if you, if you get this thing after you've used it, you extend it all the way out and put that tab right there. And then you just start to accordion fold it. And what you want, say, is to check it. If you put it in here, is it going to be wide enough just to catch that Velcro? If you can see that, just to catch that Velcro at the end. And then I know how wide I want it. So I just keep accordion folding it. And uh, I'm cheating a little because this one's been pre-folded so many times. But just accordion fold it back and forth until you fit it in there. Push it into the back. Pull this Velcro over here tight, this closure loop tight. And then zip it shut. And that's it. Just accordion fold it in there and you're just trying to make sure that this Velcro here, this Velcro strip, lines up with the Velcro there. That way, it doesn't come out when you're using it, hanging from the helicopter and you're going down to your victim, but when you need it and you're reaching around to grab it, you give it a good tug and it comes out all the way, and then you have your crotch strap. I'm Mario Batoni for Life Saving Systems. If you have any questions or comments, visit us at support.lifesavingsystems.com. Thanks.